everyone, this is Maria from the IKEA Kitchen's apartment in Houston. I'm going to show you today how to work the kitchen planner. The program is available for you online as well as here in the store. The first thing you need to come into the store is you're going to need your measurements, or you can do this at home. You're going to want to go ahead and put your measurements of wall A and wall B right over here to the right hand side. So let's start with the basic kitchen. Let's say it's 10 by 10. So we're going to put 120 inches for wall A and 120 inches for wall B. And let's say your ceiling height is 96 inches. Go ahead, go ahead and press apply. You're going to want to also put in doors and windows if you have any. Let's say you have an opening to the right hand side and let's say you have a window down here at the bottom. You can change the measurements of your window on the right hand side. So let's say the window is 36 inches wide. Alright, so then we're going to go ahead once you put your windows and doors, you can go to the kitchen tap section and you can go ahead and start with your built-in kitchens and you usually want to start with your base cabinets. Most people start with their sink cabinets and work away, work um, from it. So let's say you want to do a 36 inch sink cabinet, which is maybe like a double bowl. So you're going to click on it and drag it down. And once you click on it, once you do your first cabinet, you're going to want to go ahead and, if you know what door style you want to do, is go ahead and change the color of the frame if you want to. We either have birch or white. And let's say you want to do the abstract white, high gloss white door. So you're going to go ahead and change it. And if you know what kind of countertop you want to do, you can change, you can pick that as well. Let's say you want to do a black countertop. And if you, you can also choo um, choose legs. Or if you want to do toe kick, whichever is optional. You can also change your handles. If you know which handles you want to go with. So let's click on any other. And if you know what kind of sink you want to get, you can also put that in as well. So we're going to go ahead and put that sink in. So then once you put your sink cabinet, we're going to go ahead and put, you want to put maybe some appliances in, that way you can get started. So let's say the dishwasher is to your left hand side. Go back to built-in and back to base cabinets and finish off your the rest of your base cabinets. So let's say you want to go put cabinets here. You can also choose um, wall cabinets as well. Once you finish with your base cabinets, you can do cabinets for corner cabinets, cabinets with doors, cabinets with glass doors, cabinets for microwaves, fan cabinets. It really depends on what you what you want. So you just click on them, and you can pretty much click on any of them. We have two different heights. We have a 30 inch tall and a 39 inch tall, whichever you prefer. And then you can also go to the little button down here at the bottom and do a 3D view. And you'll be able to see your kitchen getting started. And the fun thing about this one is you can change the flooring if you know what kind of flooring color you're going to get just to get a more realistic view. So let's say you're going with dark wood floors and you know what kind of paint wall you're going to be getting. Say maybe like a dark gray or something, just to give you a better, better view. We also we also have appliances down here as well. And the good thing about our appliances, they're all made by Whirlpool. They come with a five-year warranty, and our kitchen cabinets come with a 25-year warranty. So we have some really good stuff here at IKEA. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free and give us a call at the store number. Our extension is 1925 or 1926. Have a great day, guys.